this one is about Hardik Pandya, the captain. Uh, how much Hardik Pandya? How much has Hardik Pandya impressed you in captaincy till now? And any advice uh, going forward? This question has come from Subodh Agarwal. Good gents, over to you. The person who can answer that said, "I'm going to be a non-striker today. You take strike." Ooh. Hardik Pandya's friend. Hardik Pandya's friend. No, okay. I've, I've what conflict I, of interest to get. No, I'll, I'll tell you what I like about Hardik Pandya. Yeah. What I like is he he likes being in the tough situation. My I don't know how he is in the change room. I've never been there. I suspect if he is demanding things of people as a leader, if you're demanding things of people, then you must be able to go and do them yourself. Yeah. No leader will get respect if he demands things and then is sitting at the back. I discovered this in a university game final that we were playing. Yeah. No relation to this standard, but in the big game, the captain stood back. Yeah. And forty years later, I still have no respect for him. Yeah. So in tough situations, he's willing to be there. You could have sent out Hunda. Yeah. But he went in. He you would have taken the he he took the new ball. That is what I like about him. I don't know how he is in interpersonal matters, in bowling changes because bowling changes. It's like your signature. It's like your handwriting. How how are you going to go about it? But he got four out of Hunda. I only think, as we discussed in the pre-show, maybe you could have used Chahal a little bit more. Mm. Still, come on. I do think honestly, I think he has done a very good job in the in the limited time that he's been a captain. Yeah. I will always judge captaincy after a couple of years because you know the golden period is when you start. You know you're fresh on the block and you know there's a lot of things going for you. You got to wait for a couple of years before you judge him on the whole as a captain. But so far, he's ticked every box that a captain needs to have leading Team India in a country which where cricket is celebrated as a religion, and he is. In many ways, surprised a lot of people who thought he wouldn't be able to do this. So, in that way, I'm very happy for him, and I think he's done a very fair job. He's gotten off to a golden start, and he seems to be carrying that momentum. But time will tell. Over a over a you know time period of two to three years is when you can actually judge him as a leader. And what I do you, like, sorry, about, sorry, I'll just say yeah. over two or three years, you'll judge how good he is when the going is good. At the moment, the going is good for him. He's got a pretty good win-loss record. And you'll judge him how good he is when the team is down, yep. because he will go through a phase when the team is a little down. That is when you'll know, okay, how good is he when the when the going is good. Everyone's a good captain. Yeah. How good a captain is he when the team is down? And I hope if you want him to lead the team to the 24 T20 World Cup, then you'd like to see him go through a down and lift the team up before that happens. Yeah. You always judge someone when they've gone through through the cycle. At the moment, he, he's he's doing fine. It's a format he understands uh, very well. It's a format, as I said, in which he's willing to play different roles himself. Uh, so at the moment, he's he's doing absolutely fine. I, yeah, he, he he surprised me a little bit as well because sometimes you get carried away by the way people look. Yeah, and you thought, oh, he's just a flashy young kid about town. Yeah, but he surprised me with the way he plays, with the way he wants to learn, with the way he's grown into the game. Some days he'll go and smash the big ones. Some days he'll stay back. He'll get a 15 out of 20. Like I told you, he got so excited that he'd got the in swinger. Hmm. And I thought, wow, man, this kid is excited about one ball that he has bowled. I just said to him, "Hardik, under hai na?" He said, "Ha, out swing to me raata hai, in swing bhi aara hai bhi." And he was so excited. You know, so <laughs> he is, uh, as they say, <laughs> never judge a book by its cover. Uh, but the thing about Hardik, which I really liked when I when I watch him, he seems to be with the team, and from whatever we can catch on camera, he seems to be with the team. Like I know you're all human; you make mistakes. You're not doing it on purpose. Yeah, he's just got to be careful that the stump mics are on. Yeah, I don't. But nothing. I don't nah, think you're we'll catching him. Yeah. No, I don't think you're catching yeah. him because I, it doesn't seem yeah. like it. Seems like he's always laughing, even when a mistake is made. He's kind of smiling. Today, he had a dropped catch of his own bowling. Uh, Ishan dropped one of his own bowling. He saw his expression. DK, you know, as a keeper, bowlers when you drop a catch, uh, they don't have the kindest expression. Besides Bumrah, <laughs> but otherwise they don't seem to have the kindest expression. As a captain as well, and as a bowler, he, he seems quite chill about. most things i think you know as viewers sometimes we read too much into it yeah. what matters most is how they are off the field yes. that will set the tone of what the players feel even when you react badly like yeah. rohit is a great example he's somebody who's very affable very fun loving guy everybody likes but on the field you know some of the expressions can be really hard and you are looking like wow did i make a massive mistake but when you know him then you realize that that is him let him react the way he wants but he, he means no harm at that as point as long as he's backing you off the field absolutely and and he and he kind of and from what we know with everybody he whatever he says at that point in time he pretty much tells all the young players hey jo field pe ho field pe rehta hai wo aise pretty team. much yeah chodo, chodo. but true. you will show emotion on the field no you're human you will yeah. show emotion on the field i agree it's what you do off the field and that is why the great leaders will always tell you that you 
you praise in public, criticize in private. So if yeah. if he thinks, damn, what is this Ishan Kishan doing? He won't say that on the field. Yeah. He might have a quiet word with him after saying, "Yeah, what was that?" Yeah. But if he does it on the field, there's 35 cameras there picking it up, and it's becoming a tabloid story. Everything's a tabloid story these days. But it's becoming a tabloid story the next day. Then everyone is weighing in with opinions. You don't want that. Yeah. So on a field, you do not want to display any animosity. You want to take the say the hard things, say them off the field.